Hi everybody, today's video was going to be on MAC eyeshadows and I had a request to do my top 10 eyeshadows. I'll just run through the colors that I have in my palette and then I'll pick out what I think would be my top 10 that I wouldn't want to be without. Uh, starting here, this is Bisque Brulee Orb Shroom Rice Paper Era Omega Wedge Cork and Coquette. This is Corduroy Espresso Brun Smut and Sketch. And on the other side, let's flip this over out of the way. Um, this is Arena, All That Glitters, Soba, Woodwinked, Tempting, Mulch, uh, Satin Taupe, Shell, uh, Green Smoke, Club, Sumptuous Olive, Humid, and satellite dreams. Now comes the hard part. <laughs> to me, the hard part is actually picking 10. I wrote down 10 and then now I'm I'm going through the colors and I'm like, no, maybe I would want that one too and that one too. So that's the thing about these eyeshadows. If you're into eyeshadow, it's, I don't know, I, I, I love them. I mean, there's a lot of other great eyeshadows out there too, but I just love MAC eyeshadows. What can I say? I always have a great, neutral color and I think out of the the three on the top I would probably pick brulee and this is my second or third one that I've had I like orb as well probably better than bisque uh, but I would say brulee you can't go wrong with that color um, what else would I pick uh, another color I wouldn't want to be without and it's fairly recent to my collection is uh, era and this is also a satin color and so is brulee brulee is a satin and era is a satin and it is a gorgeous gorgeous color i think anybody can wear it any age it's it's a great shadow to mix with other shadows wear it on its own it's very very nice so i would pick um era hmm what else did i put down here uh i also picked Arena. I, I'm grouped them as far as finishes. So this is Arena. I'm sorry that the camera doesn't give all the subtleties, but this is gorgeous. Sort of peachy and, and satin is a fantastic finish to have. Um, so uh, Arena would be another one. So that's three. If I was to go into the mats, I really, there's so many that I love, but I really love Corduroy. And this does show that it's a little bit on the kind of uh, reddish brown and it is a beautiful eyeshadow and I don't hear that many people talking about it what else would I pick oh I would pick wedge I, I love uh, cork as well but I think I would pick wedge it's very neutral it's a great crease color it's just it's beautiful and it's very wearable every day you can put some era and and some wedge in the crease and you're you're good to go especially if you like a, a very natural type look what else would i pick um well omega <laughs> would be one as well uh that's in a mat and you can see i use i've had this for a long time and i, al I already repurchased another one because i've hit pan quite a bit and i like it for my brows as well as i like it in the crease it's it's a nice it's a nice transition color um and a kind of a staple in my palette Let's see, if I was to pick, um, well, you have to have a Velux, something Velux Pearl. There's no doubt that any MAC palette, small or large, you have to have some Velux Pearl shadows. So I think I would pick uh, All That Glitters. I find it looks like a rose gold. Um, so I would pick All That Glitters, Woodwinked for sure. Every palette should have Woodwinked in it. It is just a wonderful, wonderful color sumptuous olive is a beautiful um green eyeshadow and it's also a Velux pearl 
Then if I only have two left, so now I have to, I would have to say mulch. This is a um, velvet, yeah, it's a velvet and um, I would repurchase this over and over. I, I do like satin top as well. I, this is one of my first eye, MAC eyeshadows I ever purchased. So yeah, but I, I think I would probably still pick mulch for myself and just let me flip this and sketch, yes. So with, with like some of these neutral, I mean, era and sketch together look great. Um, woodwinked and sketch together look fantastic. Um, so it's nice to have a few colors that are a little bit darker. So those would be my top 10 um, MAC eyeshadows if I had to scale it down. I, w I wouldn't want to be without those. Of course, I don't want to be without any of them, but just for the sake of the video, I picked 10 and, and hopefully um, this could be helpful. So anyways, thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye.